Good evening, everyone. Uh, thank you for joining for this prime time Saturday night Atlantic League broadcast. We're joined by Ted Livermore uh, for his game against Steven Deutsch, uh, which was played earlier in the week. This is a Group D clash. Ted's currently in the driver's seat of Group D with a 4-0 and record. Uh, Steven has uh, not yet played a game, so this is his first game in Group D, first of seven. And... Uh, who have been, uh, you know, happy to get this one. I've, I've heard this is a, a good one. And Max Goldman, uh, Prime subscriber. Max, thank you very much for your Je for your Jeff Bezos money. It will uh, get my kid uh, off the streets and back in school. Thank you so much. Uh, so, uh, like I mentioned, joined by Ted Livermore tonight. Ted, how are you doing? I'm doing well, Justin. I'm so excited to be spending my Saturday night talking uh, about pre-recorded Twilight Struggle rather than, you know, out with friends or doing anything. So... Here we go. Yeah, um, and that's uh, that's great. This is this is exactly what you uh, you should be doing. I know this is everybody's ideal plan uh, for how to spend their Friday evening. And uh, this hand looks uh, quite mediocre to bad. Uh, no problems, but also no access uh, and no fours. Uh, so yeah, this is not great. This. Would, if we see 442, this would strike me as probably an AI war headline unless you wanted to get cute and go C5. Yeah, I um, I was thinking about both of those. Um, you know, well, so yeah, there's no, no good headlines here to really do any damage. And then after that, one three op, and then obviously got to kind of wait on five year plan. So yeah, I mean, if you see 332, I guess you could go Suez, but getting it defectors is a complete nightmare. Uh, with our with our lack of ops and obviously eating a purge here is a bigger nightmare. Okay, just a regular old four four two. So C five yeah. hunting for Asia is fine, I think. AI war would be my headline. Getting purged here would be a nightmare. Yeah. So don't do that. Okay, I will try. Okay, so he picks up a couple of VP on the Nazis. We miss the roll. Yep. Don't worry. Missing rolls is uh, okay. Become a theme here. We are we are a tad choppy here, but it looks like we tried the three op coup with our only big card. We rolled a four, uh, yep. so it takes him out, gets us one, and we're hoping to not see a coup back here. Hoping very fervently not to see a coup back. Yes, because that would be bad. A coup, a successful coup back, and then I'm like cooing with a two op or, ugh, it's yep. bad. Yep. It is. Yeah, we also have five-year plan Korean War in our hand, which is a little bit awkward because we've re we really need to take Korea. We need to take South Korea by the end of this turn. Um, Truman's of course, Truman of course is not a problem, and I think we'll probably want to solidify. If we don't see a coup here, I assume we we'll want to solidify Iran and get into South Korea would be our our first priority. Question is, is Steven feeling frisky? And by the fact that, yeah, okay, he's not feeling frisky. Yeah, I, I, four up coup there would have been would have been bad for me. So I was very happy to see him not do that. Yeah. So filling up France and not getting out of Israel on AR one uh, suggests that this is a man with Europe scoring. Yeah. Well, but also you know Suez and AI were gone. So yeah. um, that's true. Yeah. Of course, you yeah. missed you missed on the war, and you yeah. just played Suez for ops. So that's yeah, fair. Yeah, so. He can, he can ignore getting out of Israel. Yep. So, like you said, here we go. Start the slow, sad, three AR climb to taking South Korea. Yeah. Uh, so, okay. So he fills up France immediately. Oh, yeah, Europe. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. No rush to space. Uh, for me, I think this would just be Truman one one Korea. Um, what do I do? I don't think I do that. Um, yeah, I, this is maybe a mistake going into Lebanon here, but I just kind of wanted to, I really was trying to distract him from going Iran, to be Got honest. It. So you want, you wanted to give him that nice, easy target for mill ops because you really didn't want to eat an Iran coup. Yeah, that was, okay. that was really my thinking. That's and reasonable. Just... Ooh, blockades away to Gaul. Okay, well, he rolls a six, so that would have been a complete disaster. Uh, all right, he still only has one mill op though, so he'll be cooing again, presumably. Uh, yes, presumably. And there's there's your Truman into South Korea. No, we Truman we took Syria, 
to take Middle East Dom. Oh, sorry. Yes, yes. I, I don't know if I love that because that tempts a coup of Iran to stop yeah. Dom. Okay, another one-up. My goodness. Oh, my goodness. And he rolls yep. a six. So we've got to coup that back now. And pray. And we do. And we get enough. Yeah. So, okay. So we cooed with a two. We rolled another four and get just enough. Okay. And now, with Europe scored, I assume we've got to five-year plan Romanian and take South Korea, assuming he doesn't take it here after the war was played for ops. I think he's got bigger priorities, though. He wants to get into Egypt. He wants to get into Thailand. So this is probably five-year plan, Romanian, two South Korea, one Iran, I, I can only assume, for you. Um, okay, so he puts one in Thailand. Yeah, and then, yeah, yep, one Iran, so yeah, that's, South yeah, Korea. That's a no-brainer. We don't need to hold on to five-year plan. Okay, uh, not a great turn for you by any means. You gave up the seven VP. You missed on the war. Middle East looks okay um but we're uh, we're not in thailand he's going to presume he will presumably take both egypt and thailand here probably get to lao okay just a two up so i assume we'll see a second in thailand and a second in egypt right uh what did he do okay this is a monster yeah mm. second in thailand second in egypt okay so d stall cia uh and we get two fours we get sock govs. Uh, wow, two fours, four threes, so eight, 20, 20, 24 ops in this hand. That is that qualifies as a monster. So yeah, this is I think a clear purge, and we're just hoping to uh, hoping not to get the yeah, that hoping not to see yep. that one. Yep, 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 yep. Yeah, not a great start here, uh, and I think you're going to be mad at me for the way that I deal with CIA. So you're going to take the coup. So you're not taking the coup of Panama. No. Taking the coup of Egypt. Okay, so that would have been a perfect role in Panama. Yeah. Uh, that yep, would have been the perfect role in Panama. And instead... We, instead, Ted is very sad. Yeah, and that's yeah, that's a very sad role. And now you have... You, so you can... Yeah, so that that's tough. You can trigger... If you trigger CIA now, you're losing presumably Angola. It presumably goes Angola. And then on his AR, he'll go into Zaire and Colombia, and your D-stall gets a lot worse very quickly. You also don't have much in the way of D-stall food. Right. So I assume you're going to hold CIA here. I am. I didn't think you'd like that, but that is that is what I'm going to do because, yeah, the D-stall just gets becomes a disaster. Yeah. So giving CIA on – you could have just given CIA on AR-1, but you you are – you know, but you're giving, uh, you're obviously giving up mill ops there. You're giving up the chance to get something into the western part, into the western part of the Middle East. And I've also given up CIA in this exact situation on AR1 and said, well, he needs a six on Iran to do anything. Right, and then he, then he goes it, ahead and rolls the six and it's just game losing. Like yeah. eating a six in Iran would just be game losing right here. So, okay. I, I'm, I'm okay with it. So we're going to just act like somebody who doesn't have D stall here. Yeah, it stopped Middle East stop. There's no reason to give, give yeah. up 3BP. Yes. Yeah. Uh, okay, yeah, we got to get into Pakistan. Oh, we've seen IP war, so we're not worried about that. Yeah, this this gets awkward quick. The purge getting affected was really, really painful, but I still think it was the right headline. Okay, it's Asia scoring that he has, so he gives up the one he might have. Maybe he has Middle East as well. So you're going to do this, and I get... Oh, God. So you have yeah. EEU... Yeah. <laughs> CIA and five year plan is seen, but Duck, as I recall, has not been seen. Yeah. So I think about this for a while and I changed my mind here and I, it's unconventional, but I think it's the right play. Okay. So I like Venezuela. I like Chile. I like Angola. Uh, talk me through the Algeria play. You just want access to France. Um, and yeah, I mean, that's kind of ultimately, I was like, you know what? He's just, he's just going to take care of three ops immediately. And so it's kind of wasted. I, I agree. I, yeah. I, I wouldn't have gone Algeria there. I'd rather, I'd sooner go Nigeria, um, Lao, maybe even to threaten Thailand. Yeah. Um, yeah. I don't like to do Mexico, but yeah, I, I like this. I like this much better. Yeah. yeah. Now, obviously he has to put one dumb. in Thailand right away, but that stops the march into Western Asia. 
Yeah, exactly. It blocks him off there, gives me temporary Dom, makes him put one in Thailand. Uh, so all of those things are good. Yeah, Max de Gaulle was blockaded away turn one. Um, so de Gaulle is, gonna, is uh, in the discard now. Um, Sock Gov presumably, uh, not presumably, definitely needs to be played for ops here. Yep, and then I got to do this fun thing. Mm, okay. I don't know that I would have... I... I, hmm. I might have... Uh, j- only, on that? I might have only refilled East Germany and gone to... Okay, well, you didn't get, you didn't get hurt for it. So that's fine. Um, I was worried about a, a big jam in, uh, in Venezuela, but obviously there are... I don't think there are four ops left. Um... I think. Have we seen U.S. Japan? Oh yeah, I guess U.S. Japan is left, so he could have jammed U.S. Japan into Venezuela, which would have been very uncomfortable for you. Yes. Um, but okay, we have Sokov, so we'll take Brazil um, and Zaire, presumably with that. Uh, we'll also, again, I'm, I'm presuming a lot of things. Want to get into India. Um, want to take Pakistan. Want to do a lot of things. Uh, obviously want to take Syria. So Nasser gives us Dom. There's a lot of things we want to do and three ops isn't going to do all of them. No. And the other problem is I, I got to put another one back into Europe because EU could come back. Yeah. Um, which, you know, unlikely, right? He, he'd have to draw EU and Europe, but it, you know, that's... Yeah, you don't want to go up 10 VP. Okay, there's Duck. So you're certainly happy to see that. Okay, yeah. Four... For in France, we just have no we have no access over there. Okay, so now I'm doing something you know you're not gonna like. Okay, wow. So we weren't even so we're just gonna just gonna event sock govs. Well, so my reasoning was I mean Brazil and Zaire, right, was what I was thinking, but here so it you know, right. So it causes him a lot of problems because it, it prevents him from stopping Asia Dom and here it ends up stopping him from preventing Europe, reestablishing Europe Dom. Okay. Okay, well, that's great if we, but if we draw the scoring, I don't know if we really want to headline it. Okay. The problem is, well, the, the thing I don't like about it is we're giving CIA next turn, probably, and we did not get into Zaire. Are okay, we well, we're not giving CIA because we drew UN and got bailed out, and we got decal. So, all right, that play worked out fine for you. De- uh, defectors, yeah, this is a clear decal headline, and you're just hoping that he does not. Yeah, have another defectors. Yeah, you're hoping he doesn't redraw it. Yeah, uh, yeah, I didn't think about the the coup uh, was having to give CIA and Angola and bad bad things. Um, I didn't think about that, but I got bailed out. Yeah, I, I really didn't like the idea of we don't draw a decal there. Um, I obviously don't get decal in UN. Then all of a sudden we're we're staring down the barrel of control in Africa. Um, now. So we can take those countries, um, I assume, what, one South Africa? Um, no, going to go a second Angola. Yeah, I, I think it actually maybe should have been Algeria, but going to do that. Okay. And then another one. Thank you very much. Okay, so we take the coup. Yeah, take the coup in Panama. Yeah, in Panama, that makes sense. Marshall to me is a much better headline than Purge if he had it, um, but no other. Some players. Uh, yeah, containment I think was his other option. I don't know that we've seen containment. Yeah, Max pointing out that he that uh, Stephen could have ignored that, and just poked Venezuela, which could have caused an issue. Oh, he's just going to jam it now, and we are purged. So yeah, we have uh, we're just gonna have to take Brazil here and concede Venezuela. Yep. But okay, all right, we did the weird sock Govs play. <laughs> I guess he he you know he had two ops, so he could have done something cool with those two ops that he then had to put into West Germany. Would have been great, but and and again, even if we'd redraw this, re, we'd redrawn the scoring. I guess you're still headlining it, figuring that. If you get EEU'd, at least he doesn't have presence as Dom. Yes. Yeah. All right. Maybe the Sokovs was not a great play, but it worked out fairly well. Yeah. Okay. So now uh, it is 
we're, we're down three. And, okay, that's just going to take Venezuela. No. No, okay. yeah, this confused me, but I guess he kind of figures that I can't really do anything about yeah, it. Yeah, but you're not going to fight that. I'm going to fight it a little bit. Okay, well, we have to, we, we clearly have to space Norad, so we have three ops left. Um, I don't know that I would have done that, but okay. I mean, we, I, we want to get into Argentina. We want to get into India. Um, yeah, we are, we are quite low on ops. But we are rid of CIA at least. Okay, there's two. And yeah, I don't know what the rush was on Panama. That seemed weird. Uh, okay, we're going to over, yeah, over protect Brazil. Yeah, I just so that, don't, uh, that yeah, doesn't I get do. jammed. Uh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. They're not getting jammed real bad because then Uruguay and all sorts of bad things happen. Yeah, okay. So <laughs> war going to space. He misses. So you're going to space Norad. You'll also miss. And then I assume what? We're going to take Argentina. Are you going to go Pakistan, India? What are, you, um, what are we going to do here? No, I, ha I, I want to get one into India because of Usuri and puppets. Yep. Um, I think that that, even just one in India, really helps me. With Asia, Dom, I continue to be worried about the state of Europe. Yeah, as well you should be. Warsaw is about to be gone. Um, yeah, Europe looking yeah, and Comic -Con very and weak. Gone. Yep. What you had a, you had a known CIA. Yeah, and he headlined Purge instead. And yeah, he headlined Purge it, instead. Yeah. Of, he didn't. He did not know about UN, right? No, he, he played UN yeah. for ops. You had a yeah. known CIA, and he played Duck. Um, and he and he headlined Purge instead of Duck. That I don't agree with that at all. Um, yeah, I didn't even notice that at the time. Okay, no, I don't go India. Yeah, oh, okay. so never he, mind. Yeah. Never mind. If he had headlined Duck, you would have flipped Thailand. Um, we, well, we we had this exact conversation in our team game the other night. We yeah. agreed that Duck was the much better headline, um, but our opponents had could, could have redrawn D-Call. Obviously, they did. You had a known D-Call, and he was undoubtedly worried about Thailand getting flipped, so that's why he didn't. He headlined yeah. Perch to save Thailand. Okay, that makes that makes sense. Okay, so here we go. Turn four. Uh, this is very nice. We got three more four ops. A for P is annoying. Bear, uh, bear traps annoying. OAS annoying. Puppets is, I suppose. Uh, yeah, puppets is pretty annoying too. But maybe we, if we have to give that, we can do it later in the turn. We're gonna hope to double space here. This is a little bit of a, as I like to say, a lot of good, a lot of bad here. Yeah, yeah, a lot of good, a lot of bad. I thought about this one for a while. Uh, this is going to be the first of two weird headlines for me, I think. Um, you know, ABM an obvious choice, but Missile Envy, you know, not really worried about that. Yeah. Um, yeah, and you're not, you don't really need to coup Thailand here. Um, no. no. You're much more interested in cooing into Central. For, okay, well, turn four, yeah, turn VLA. four, voice, always good. <clears throat> so that's probably what Zaire, Angola, and Chile would probably be my play, um, unless he has Asia in hand, in which case he could uh, take maybe Lao, in Lao, Indonesia, something like that. Um, try and just steal a coup with it. Assuming he doesn't have any scorings, I think I like one Chile and take out Angola and Zaire, and hope that you don't have Portuguese or South African. Yeah, and then and then the decision to hold ABM becomes even better now because now I'm licking my my lips because I you know he's just gonna walk right in Angola. And another one, thank you. Okay, that was a that's a great one, but at least it does something and saves you a VP thanks to Lad. So brilliant headline there. Mm hmm. Okay, so he's he's gonna walk in Angola. Will ABM that? Okay, yeah, this, that would have been my play with VOA. It's a good head. Obviously, VOA turn four is seldom not a good headline. Grain pretty much the only thing I prefer over it. Um, okay, so we'll ABM Angola. 
Uh, and then we've got to figure out a way to get back into South America, but we are, we can probably get back into the other half of South America. But we have the ops here to maybe just bully our way there. Yeah, well, and then Lads also helps with the Uruguay yeah. play. Yeah. Then now we're going to want to, so we're going to ABM in Angola. We're going to want to trigger arms race, I can only assume, for and get our VPs. Casual turn four flower power, Justin. Yeah, casual turn four flower power. Um, oh, and he's going to take central dom. But you're nothing. Nothing you can do about that. We've got to deal with Angola here, and you are presumably gonna. If any roll is fine. You get a three. Perfect. Yeah, that was really how. I'm really glad I didn't headline ABM there because that that saved me two battlegrounds. Yep. Um, and you know, neutered v, VOA pretty good. Yep. Yep. Okay. That, yeah, that'll help. So we, I assume you'll want to do arms race next and then you can go NTB into Uruguay. You're given Marshall here, but Europe, yeah. you're fucked in Europe anyway, right? Yeah. I mean, you're, you're not fighting this. Your only hope was a Willie headline dump Europe or sock Gov's headline dump Europe. Like you're not actually going to fight it unless of course we get brush war. Um, but yeah, Marshall's not too bad here. Puppets is bad, Bear Trap's bad, and obviously we're probably holding OAS. This is a little tricky. Are we, I assume we're just gonna try and double space here. Oh, EEU for ops. Yeah, yeah, that would have been a problem for me. Well, no, so I had the, four, the fourth one in Poland at this point. Oh, you did, I, okay. I did, yeah, yeah, yeah. So that, that's, that's another reason. And then this confused me a little bit. So he goes one Botswana, which I think is reasonable, but then the one Brazil, and so I'm like, <laughs> You know, if he wants to try the walk in Uruguay again, Lads is on my side here. Yeah. I yeah. So the one in in Brazil, and that does the thing that I I think it's I think it was Zima Witt is said with don't encourage your opponent to make a good play, um, and the one in Brazil encourages you to go to Uruguay, which is exactly what he doesn't want you to do. Yeah. Right. He doesn't want you to go to Uruguay because then he has to coup. With the with the die with the die roll modifier under lads. Yeah, I was trying to figure this out for a while. I was like, what he was what he was doing here. Realizing I have to play Marshall, and so um, everything Zaire. And I don't I don't know if this was the right play. Maybe Uruguay was better. So you but... took Zaire and Botswana, and you, so you're okay. So you're gonna let him have Uruguay and then coup it with NTB. That's your plan. Yes, I, yes, my yes. That was that was the plan. Is I will take a big five op coup on Uruguay okay I, I would have just gone in there and let him roll the dice but all right and we're taking Botswana which sets up Africa Dom that's obviously not nothing and yes you pointed out uh, correctly that you that taking Syria uh, did give you uh, Middle East Dom. So we'll yeah, see. Yeah, he's he holding containment, that. by the way. That was he 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 played Nasser uh AR six turn three instead of containment. He has containment. Okay. Uh, so that was I you know, it was an interesting choice. I don't necessarily disagree with it, but it's interesting. Whenever I hold containment to the mid war, I always find something better to headline. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the ops. problem. Yeah, he holds it for a while. I think he holds it through this entire turn. Okay, so after mm -hmm. I don't okay. Yeah, so now I don't understand that. Up. All right, fine. Yeah. You stop Asia Dom, so you'll just retake it. Yeah, I'm happy to fill those battlegrounds. That's a that's a three op play that you can answer with one, uh, which I don't which I don't like. Okay, all right. So he's got Southeast, yeah. so saves two VPs with the three ops. We hit and we're holding our breath here, presumably. Mm hmm. Because we can't give either of these cards. Oh, that's that's yeah. a disaster. I was pretty upset at this point uh, in yeah. the game. That was a really, really, really aggravated card for him to have. And now we have a tough decision because you want your VPs, but you also really want to get into Uruguay. Yeah. Yeah. So you've got to event that. And now you, I, you, you can't bear trap AR seven. You can't give no. OAS on this board. No. You have to play China. Yeah. Yeah. Play China. It's not not even really a, a decision here. So you've got to play China. Um, he needs mill op, so he wants to coup, but I think you've got to go Uruguay because otherwise he'll go Uruguay. Maybe two yeah, Uruguay, two South yeah, Africa. Yeah. 
No, so I'm poking Venezuela for South America Dom. Okay, so, so we get South Uruguay. America Dom. All right. Yeah. So he can't. He can't. Obviously, he can't fix that and go Uruguay. Well, if he has if he has a three op, he could fix that and poke Uruguay. Yeah. Um, give up the mill ops, which would not be a bad play. No, that would yeah. be a good And play. you're going to be holding Bear Trap and OAS, and he's got Headline Peak. Yep, fun stuff. I was, I mean, I'm definitely ahead on yeah. the board. You have here. four Doms on the board, well, which, I, okay. Oh, OPEC, uh, that's what, two? Okay. Yeah, I and think he, he should have given up the, yeah. Okay, so he gives up the one. Yeah, I think, I don't know. I would have given up the VP there, but okay. All right, we got three Doms on the board. Well, no, now we only have, because he stopped. Two of them. So we have two doms on the board to his two. Um, okay. Okay. Um, this is pretty nice. Junta gets us in the bottom half. We can lower DEFCON. And then, yeah, we've got... We can space bear trap. We have to give up the Pope. We can five-year plan OAS. This is nice unless we eat Missile Envy. Don't get so, Missile well, Envy here, please. Yeah, I'm worried about defectors is the other thing. So yeah. I think Junta's a better headline. But I was worried about defectors. If if it, if Quagmire gets defected, I can still play Huda, no problem. Yeah, yeah. Um, and this is why Huda is a better headline. Yeah. Uh, yeah. So that's annoying. Yeah, I I will I will sometimes use Quagmire for defectors insurance uh, with Huda as well uh, if I'm yeah. really worried about it. But okay, so we don't get any points in South America. But, but I, will... can, can, I can walk into Argentina now. Yes. I think this is still an AR1 Junta, right? Because he's under Quag. You're going to go You go Panama. And then the question is, are you feeling frisky enough to go Panama, coup Mexico, and hope you get a huge roll? Or are you just going to go Panama, coup Panama? Well, the other thing I was thinking about here was Bear Trap, because he's quagged. My hand kind of sucks. Like, not sucks, but I have these problems. So I was really considering playing Bear Trap here while he's quagged. Okay. So you Bear Trap, and then... Probably just Coup Panama. You Coup Panama with Bear Trap, he, and then presumably he gets out, you get out, and then he can just repair or whatever, and you, and you move right. on. And it's a good time to get rid of Bear Trap. That lets you get rid of both Bear Trap... And the Pope. And the Pope, yeah. Um, oh, yeah, and the Pope is a big is problem bad. for you here. Yeah. So I decided not to do that, but yeah. that's what I was thinking about. That might be a little too cute. Okay, so we put we put the two in there, we coo, we miss on the roll. Of course, we miss on all the rolls, Justin. Yeah, okay, so he gets out, so this should just be two Panama and then at least one Argentina, probably... One Argentina, one Iraq would be my play. Yeah, I what else did he do? He what, has what China. Did he do I, I went one Argentina, two Panama with you two. I ignored Iraq. Um, oh, I, okay. I, I would use the four up, but okay, sure. He is China. Yeah. Oh, and you didn't want um, a Korea getting jammed. All right. Yeah, I'm still worried about missile envy this whole time, um, and I just kind of made the decision that I just wasn't going to play around it. Um, and yeah, I, so you, you can see me thinking about it, and then I'm like. And then I decide, no, let's hold the four to defend against China. I mean, a North Korea jam, like, I don't think it's the end of the world, but it's not great either. No, no, indeed. Okay. Uh, well, if we had, if we were going to see Brush, we would have seen it there. What does Egypt do for us? Um, it prevents him from taking Saudi Arabia and stopping the Dom. Gives me one extra VP for Middle East scoring. Okay, which we I don't know. we think he has. I, I, okay, all right. Hoping Sadat doesn't get drawn. Yes, yes. I would have been happy to just put the one into Saudi Arabia, but okay. Yeah, I mean, or North Korea, frankly. We had because we already have Dom. He needs to. I mean, I guess one Jordan stops Dom. Um. Or would, and now it doesn't. Okay, there goes There's containment, finally. So he takes Saudi. Yeah, I mean, we're spacing Bear Trap at this point. Right? Yeah, we, yeah, we, we, have, mean, we have to space Bear Trap. Yeah, they're both empty action rounds, so... 
Just did that first. I don't think it really mattered. Yep, and you are a man who's anxious for your scorings to come out. Yes, I am. Because I see three of them. I see three nice dominations for you. Now, Asia could be stopped with Burma Philippines. Yeah, I can respond by taking Afghanistan. Uh, yeah, um, which he'd respond by taking Taiwan. Uh, Africa, you're you're in good shape. He needs he needs CRGs to break in there. South America's scored. I, I would like to see us get one into Chile before the end of the turn, but sure. Okay, well, there's his scoring, so that's yep. good. That's good that his scorings came. Right, we miss on the roll yet again. We still need our mill ops. And we looks like we probably aren't gonna get them because no, we, we aren't gonna, gonna be cooing with five year plan. Okay, he looks like he's gonna get his mill ops right here. I don't know if Kung Botswana was the best there, but okay, so now I finally decide to use my four op. Mm, just take South Africa? Yeah, that's what I end up doing. Yeah, OAS, oh man, OAS with the bottom half of South America like that is annoying, even with five year plan, but South America scored central is not, so I guess you're thinking, let's just, you know, if I have to give up Chile or whatever. That's fine. I'll just make sure. I think I also yeah. wanted to. So, like South Africa is obviously very stable. I have six in Angola at this point, yep. and so I wanted to make it so that right, if we're just fighting over one hinge, one of the one stabs. Yeah, right, yeah, you didn't I want have to a have a distinct advantage uh, there in Africa. Yeah. So that was my that was my thinking there. So he okay. plays China right after I play my four op, of course. Yep. He does the thing. Which I'm annoyed by. Yep, he does your thing. Okay, so he presumably he can flip. So he can flip North Korea here, which would get make Asia five countries to five. Okay, one Panama, one Argentina. That makes sense. Well, yeah, I didn't because now I'm gonna just ignore Argentina. It's already scored. I don't really care. Yeah, I, I this, that's and that's how I'd respond. That makes sense too. Yeah. So I, I think he would have been better off putting two at Panama there. Okay. And um, yeah. Yeah. I mean, I know the access, I guess, to him is important down there, but I, you know, I can put two into North Korea, which makes it significantly harder for him to take. Yep. No, that's true. Yeah. He's got, so now he's got a four, presumably with what are we, we going to see Brezhnev here? No, he's got Nixon going to take the, to take, take the China card back. Okay. So he jams. He jams North Korea, which was a good play, but he doesn't have a follow-up to it. Okay, and here are our scorings. Yes. They do come, and we have a safe missile envy. Fidel is hugely important. De Gaulle is useless. Um, Libs is strong. Man, we got a lot of good... Asia's a fine headline here. Yeah. Um, yeah, what would you headline here? Gone. Um, I mean, I guess... Well, I guess we can't headline Asia because of CRG stops Dom, and CRG is an excellent headline for him. CRG stops Dom in both Africa and Asia, so I don't think we can headline a scoring uh, given the fact that still around. Headline. Defectors is around. Um, he oh, yeah, and he's got headline peak, so we're absolutely not yeah. headlining a scoring. Yeah. Missile Envy is reasonable because it, not necessarily for the first half, but for the second half to make right. sure his AR1 play can only be two ops. Um. But I think Libs is fine. Libs Libs causes damage. Also, Libs baits out defectors. If he has defectors, he has right. to defect that, that and that's not what I was and about. not play yeah. CRG. Yeah, yeah, that was the other thing I was thinking about. Yeah, CRG is a nightmare here um, for me. So, yeah, defectors. I th I got in my head about defectors uh, with that that Quagmire Junta play. Um, Defectors was scary all game. I, it was uh, PTSD from Purge getting. Yeah, that was, a, that, too. Was a bad, yeah. Uh, that was bad. Yeah, it was bad. I mean, nothing. I, I you know, like Sockovs wasn't particularly. No, exciting. you had to. Yeah, you had to make him have it. You had to make him have it there. So, so he's up eight. I'm definitely ahead on the board, and I got you know three regions here. Middle yeah. East pretty tenuous because he also now stupid Sadat flips it to his dom. Yeah. 
um, which is problematic. Yeah, and I would have liked, I would have liked to just see one in Saudi Arabia, but instead of Egypt. But okay, all right, we'll see if he's got Sadat. Uh, we're gonna make him have Sadat, and so he's thinking real hard, which presumably means this is gonna be CRG. No, no, yeah. So this I don't that really care about. That is extremely ignorable. Yeah. So yeah. what do you do now? So if you take a coup, so and you could think about a miss. Uh, could you think about a missile envy event here? What's out there? Um, you could also that? just you could also just score Asia, yeah, and then give him the coup. If he coups Africa, fine. We will still have Dom. Yeah, and yeah. I can take Mexico. Yeah, I think I I think I like that. And now yeah. if he takes a coup. We either can take Mexico, or we can take North Korea back, or we can score Africa because we'll still have Dom. Right. Yeah. That's why I was like, I don't. He can go ahead and go Africa. That's fine with me. Yeah. So let's just cash in our VPs here. Now, obviously, we want to get Fidel invented as soon as humanly possible. But of course, he's not going to score Central right here. He's going to want to take a coup somewhere or he won't he's just going to take mexico back and put one north korea i don't i don't know that i understand that mexico is realignable if you take it he can realign it i think i would have counted on that and not given you a coup okay well you miss on the roll yeah i mean that probably should have been argentina i was um yeah that gives me control is what yeah, i was thinking that was a tad greedy yeah it was it, that should have been argentina um should have been Argentina. I was a little greedy, but okay, okay. Um, so he'll take he'll he has to take Algeria back. A special is no problem at all. We presumably will want to take Argentina or get into Chile with that. We could also ah, there we go. Yeah, there it now is. I don't have, know why he didn't headline that. That's so much better headline than Panama. I don't. Yeah. So now we're just gonna fix Nigeria and Zaire. I briefly thought about scoring, but then long, no, long no, 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 no. This is this is the right play. You got to do this. Now we have five, six countries to his two, so no danger of losing Dom here. We'll just you need the real lines too. Yes, yeah. yeah. If he if he hits the real lines, no big deal. We'll still score a nice five point Dom. We are going to want to get Fidel evented. Yeah, I'm aware, Justin. I got too many things to do, man. Yeah, right. yeah. No, yeah. you. I, I know we we want to. You need to guarantee that Africa Dom. Want to make sure like you don't lose it to a brush, but you also got to get Fidel evented. Um, oh, Jr. wanted the Algeria coup too. Yeah. Yeah, Argentina was better. I just, I was like, you know what? If I hit that, I get Africa control, and that seems really good. He's going for a two-op real line, hits the roll. But now I'm scared. This is a real problem for me here. The second real line roll is a real problem. Yeah, Panama bad. Yeah, so thinking about Panama. Okay. Yep, yeah, so, all right, we're just going to score, yeah. Yeah, that, that Panama real line scared me. Cause yeah, if he gets a decent roll there. You are yeah. on your, you're really on the back foot. Yeah, so now I'm looking through the cards. And so I is Muslims around or he spaced that? I think Muslims is around. Brush, okay. obviously, is the key card yeah. here. Yes. So I was looking at the missile envy options, and it was like it was brush, it was cultural, I think maybe Che, Brezhnev, and then Kennedy was the only one on his side. Those were the three. Something yeah. was a, about that. Um, I don't recall Muslims. Yeah, there it is. So this has got to be Panama, right? It's got to be. Yeah. yeah, it has to be Panama. So... Oh, JR! JR. JR is it. Yeah, just completely JR is the full strength brush. Okay. Yeah. So that's a sigh of relief. Now it's just Fidel, right? Just an immediate well, Fidel. So now, you know, because the Muslims is gone. There's Muslims in the discard. So there are no four ops left. So it's only three ops. So the three ops, again, it's like Brezhnev, Che, Cultural, Kennedy. 
So, yeah, Fidel, I want to event, but I decide to go with this because if he has central, I don't think it's unreasonable to go for brush on Panama before scoring central. Oh, no, absolutely not. I, yeah. Right. And so yeah. I, I can play Miss Lenby here, and then no matter what happens, right, he's got to play Miss Lenby, and then I can event Fidel. Okay. All right, right. that's fine. So what are we, we're hoping to hit Brezhnev is a nothing. It's one op. Maybe not even that if we're spacing Camp David. Yeah. Um, uh, che. Che, che is very nice. Che is very nice. Cultural is very okay, nice. So, all right, so you, you, I'm happy you with snipe that. Kennedy. Yeah. So that's good. Um, is it worth taking a coup of Guatemala? Yeah, you're thinking about the Guatemala coup, so Fidel gives you Dom. Right. Um, I would, Even yeah. I mean, right Argentina, back. just taking Argentina and getting just, yeah. just doing that. I would yeah. so much rather see that than yeah. uh, maybe get 2 VP. Yeah. yeah. Um, I like this better. I guess we don't really have to worry about the Chile Chile play at the moment because Brush is gone. Brush and ABM are gone. I end days around, so. Yeah. Not getting one of the Chile is not a disaster. And the fact that he doesn't get to hold Kennedy to turn seven is nice. Yeah. And the fact that it appears Middle East will not score before Sadat is uh, more annoying. But okay, we get Fidel. And now, if he has it, he's going to have to give you the two. So we get the two the two big scorings. Middle East would have been nice before Sadat, obviously. Um, I'm feeling better now than I was at one point. I think at the beginning of this turn he was up eight VP. And there's Che. So he gave he gave Kennedy instead of Che. Well, is, I, which I, I think I probably agree with, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, mean, I think it's a. I, I do think it, you'd have to think about it, but. Um, uh, well, because Gunman's unseen is the other thing. So yeah. I don't know, man. I mean, Che's brutal uh, access to Algeria there, but with Gunman unseen, I don't know. Oh, there's my Middle it. East. Yeah. So uh, my one in Egypt. Fuck you, Justin. Hey, wow. Okay. He was waiting. He yeah, was ho he wait, hoping you had to play Sadat. Yeah. Oh, yeah. look, Defectors. We got it. So you don't have we to worry did, about finally. it. We did, finally. And so he is Gunman. Okay. So then the other thing I realize here is no reshuffle. No reshuffle. He presumably has gunmen, but not definitely. Right. So there's one card in the draw here. And you um, have five dominations on the board. Yes. Um, so there's Central is out there. I think Willie Brandt, uh, gunmen, obviously. Uh, there's Yeah. It seems like a fine CMC headline. Yeah, he has grain. Is the other thing is yeah. he what he has. Um, so yeah, CMC just to stick him with Gunman, assuming he has it. Yeah, and we need to get some ops into Eastern Europe, please. Yeah, that's that's my other problem. Is, is uh, that yeah, because yeah, Europe is control big big problem. Defcon also not nothing now. I believe Nixon was invented. You sorry played for ops. You'll play cultural. You'll certainly event cultural here. Um, right. CIA still around though. CIA, yeah, yeah. CIA is around. Obviously, he has grain. Well, the deck's going to reshuffle, so uh, we'll reshuffle afterward. Now, what's the status of Omit? Yeah, I think he has Omit. Yeah. So if he has Omit, he can trigger the reshuffle. Yeah, I didn't think about that. Yeah, so obviously you still headline grain, even though you have a lot of garbage in your hand and he knows it. So flower power is uh, in effect. Just event that. Yeah, that's. I mean, just def cons too. Yeah, it's not. Yeah, it's not really a decision. Yeah, that's, that's what he's gonna do. Event. Yeah, he also has the dot. That's the other thing. So yeah. I immediately take China. Um, why did I? I felt quite the urgency to take China, and I don't recall why. I mean, it was the gunman. I wanted to stick him with gunman. I mean, you if he because uh, you you were gonna have to 
not hold a card. Well, unless you invented salt, which you weren't going to do with him having gunmen. So he presumably was going to play China. Yeah, there was some reason. There Turkey some and reason. Mexico? Just take North Korea. No, he's putting one in. Uh, yeah, I don't understand the Mexico thing. He's putting one in Turkey the, because of CMC. Okay, fine. He knows your hand is garbage, though. Yeah, he does. I There is a reason. I can't. Why was I freaking out about China? I forget. I don't but understand now, why he didn't just take North Korea. That would seem like a much better play there, but okay. Yeah, um, so now I can do this, and now I can distract him. So you could Saharan, so he's got to then go... He's got to then take Algeria now. Yeah, and not for nothing, he just played our man, so no reshuffle. Yeah, and I'm... Yeah, okay. I think it was to his benefit, to given the state of the yeah, board. Yeah, he wants to keep the scorings out. Oh, you think he doesn't want to reshuffle? You think that... Yeah, he doesn't want to reshuffle because he wants to keep the scorings in the discard pile. Okay, all right, that's fair. Now he obviously doesn't want to, you know, this obviously gives you a much better chance to get war games. Right, now it becomes 50-50 on war games. Now he does Also that. gives you a much better chance to get Aldrich and Terrorism. Yeah. And doesn't give you a chance to get CIA. Yeah. Right, yeah, yeah. I think I might have triggered a reshuffle there. I, I also I don't understand triggered a reshuffle. why Sadat needed to happen there instead of taking Algeria. Because he just lets me walk straight into Algeria. Yeah. Yeah, it doesn't make it doesn't make a ton of sense to me. Um, yeah, I think triggering the reshuffle was the right thing to do. I mean, just the war games, fifty fifty on war games, I think is enough. I mean, maybe it's maybe it's Europe. Um, I'm trying to put myself in Stephen's shoes. Yeah, here. no, Europe. Maybe is, maybe is, you'll ignore Europe, and this gives me a much better chance to get yes, Chernobyl it does. It does, uh, and yeah. tear down next turn. Um, yeah, so uh, now EEU is also is in the discard. But, yes, leaves um, EEU but, in the discard, but Star Wars for EEU. Star Wars and Solidarity. Yep. Um, Solidarity is going to come. So, yeah, now I, I think I realize this, and I start freaking out a little bit about Europe. Yeah, so East Germany, I believe, is at three, isn't it? And Poland is at one five. Yeah. Pope's in effect. Might also have been a good event. Yeah, that might have been a good event. Okay, we're going to coup so Colombia to stop those realigns yep, and care. set up realigns of our own. I want to rather go Nicaragua, I think. But I, uh, I'm really trying to remember. There was a reason why I wanted the China card so badly. I think, oh, you know what? I, I think I just wanted I think I just wanted the China card so that I could get a discard or I could get terrorism or Aldrich. Um Right. I guess really but you were getting way. China anyway. You didn't yeah. have he yeah. he could have know he, why. You you do an AR one so that he doesn't play China and get to hold two cards. Right. You really didn't want him to hold gunman and something else. Does he have something else bad? Does he have a bad two? His hand is is bad because it's like you know I don't know what the one card is obviously but central is still out there right uh, Willie Brandt um, Allende yeah, there's Allende so I'm just putting him in a position yeah I think China would have been pretty good for him just to clear out some just to yeah. not have to play some crap here. Okay, space defectors to stay in war games territory. Miss the roll yeah. again. Yeah, I like that. That's fine. Again, can we please get some ops into Europe? Jesus Christ, Ted. We can't <laughs> leave. You cannot leave Europe with no, especially with no reshuffle at three. At East Germany at three and Poland at one five when you dominate. When you, when you have five, okay, even four dominations on the board. Come on now. And a seven VP lead. Oh, you're making me nervous, Ted. You um, live to do that, though. I do. Yeah. I mean, look, I said 50 50 chance of war games right now. It's fine. You yeah. don't need to worry about anything. Don't worry about it. I don't need to worry about Europe. So he plays an early Brezhnev, which helps me quite a bit. Early Brezhnev. So this is just Haiti, Panama. Yeah, this is easy. James in the chat now. James with his like eighty nine percent winning yeah. percentage after 
one we had one AR left before he could draw Chernobyl and just win. <laughs> Well, no, because he has to. Europe has to come yes, back. Yes, Europe has to come back, and you have to not get war games. Yes, and and you have to also not get Aldrich or terrorism. But he now he does have a headline peak. To be fair, he has got headline he peak, does. so he has a, he has um, he has ways to get out of gunman. Yeah, gunman's not that bad. Okay, okay finally, so there it's, okay, finally okay, gives it gives central gives you the four. You're up. No, no, I have a four up. I can make. Gotta retake North Korea. Gotta. Okay, and Asia. Yeah, well, yeah, and, and then you scroll up. Say, oh, hmm, maybe that's important. Don't just poke West Germany, Stephen. Just yeah, poke West Germany. Yeah, that would have been bad for me. You could have done that. All right, war games, and then let's go home. Okay. Wow, Aldrich and terrorism. Do we and and we get Chernobyl? So all right, this is all the stuff that we need. Um, we do. Only thing we don't have is a degrader. So degrader. I assume we're going to headline reformer to make gunman extra painful. Uh, and then if he doesn't headline, we go ahead and coup and Aldrich. Oh, interesting. Okay, so you headline reformer. How does that make gunman extra extra painful? Well, because because then you get reform. Well, I guess reformer just isn't that good. Never no, mind. it's not. Reformer, okay. normally, it's like, it, it's extra painful because you can then, Reformer, you get a coup with Gunman, and then you can also, and then you can push further on Reformer. Yeah, um, yeah in this but case. In this, on this painful. board, Reformer is going to be used on defense. Yes. Um, even with Chernobyl in our hand, yeah. So clear Gunman. Yeah, that's the Gunman. And he gets good stuff, too. Mm, yeah, but Aldrich here now takes away his best card yeah. by far. Um, Latin American debt crisis is a problem. Yeah, yeah. I mean, yeah, let's just just take tear down. Yeah, uh, I don't know what I was thinking about. I think I was maybe thinking between war games and tear down, but yeah, tear down. Yeah, this is just there's a clear tear down here. You don't want him getting three influence in uh, Germany. Oh, you get to look at his hand again. I know. That was fun. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that. I got to look at his hand twice. Okay. We know he doesn't have Glasnost. Are you going to hostage crisis and terrorism so that he has to miss two ARs? Um, or with this terrible hand, are you going to th are you going to try and hold terrorism? Neither. Neither of those things. Neither of those things. Okay. Um, what do I care about right now? I like, guess protecting Cuba. Yep, that's that's what I'm gonna do. Just, I'm happy to have a coup war there. Do that. There's nothing in his hand I'm particularly worried about. Yeah. So we can't space garbage. this, so yeah, this is maybe not the best play with AWACS in my mm, hand. Yeah, we're giving AWACS here, I think. I don't want to give AWACS because I want Muslims active. Yeah. Okay. So we space AWACS. I mean, I, I kind of like <laughs> holding terrorism. But uh, activating terrorism and then maybe holding it, but all right, that's that's maybe a little too cute. Um, we know he doesn't have Glasnost or a discarder, so we can hang on to the reformer for a little bit, but that's a nice, easy event. Uh, activate Glasnost there, yeah. I think at this point, I know he has Willy Brandt. And so I'm waiting for him to play Willie, um, and uh, presuming that he's only going to put one back in West Germany. Yeah. So that then the reformer becomes a pain in his ass. Ah, uh, I see. Okay. That's what I'm waiting for on the reformer. Which I don't, I don't know if that logic makes sense, but that's what I was thinking. So, and then we can fight over Saudi Arabia all day. That's fine with me. 
There's Willie. He poos with that. Yep, just gonna just gonna get his mill ops. Okay, hits the roll. Yeah, that's a little bit of a problem. For so me. we can Panama, realign but... Panama. He can realign Panama. Yeah, but okay. you can now event reformer. Yeah, you feel a little bit better about Europe now. Yes, yes, and Chernobyl's gonna be gone. So yes, I feel I do feel better about Europe. I'm glad. I think I think about dicking around and like. Don't <laughs> dick around. Just West Germany, <laughs> East Germany, Poland. No, don't do this. That's stupid. Well, I do it anyways. Okay, you only put one into Poland when we have solidarity in our hand. Well, solidarity is going to get spaced. Okay. It's going to be terrible space rolls. See, I don't, I'd almost rather just give solidarity here and get it out of the deck because that's going to, because the deck's going to reshuffle. Yeah, it could come back. Yeah. Uh, I don't, yeah, I don't want, I don't want solidarity coming back. I don't want tear, you know, solidarity and teardown could come back. Yeah, so terrorism, I wanted, yeah, that was what I was thinking. I did not, that was the one I didn't want to hit out of the three. I wanted to force him to play that. Okay. Because that's, that's a real problem for him. All right, so fine. We're, we're spacing solidarity, and we are going to uh, obviously give Chernobyl. Yeah, he, yeah. JR says he was already forced to play that. You you realize that right, Ted? Yeah, but okay. Now he's gonna uh, miss an action round. Okay. I don't know, man. Look. <laughs> okay. All right. I'll just I'll take my South America Dom. Okay, he can jam shit. I'm gonna play Chernobyl and AR early. You guys can hate on that too. That's this is fine. This is fine. You know what he has in his hand. Yeah, he's got a crappy two up. I forget what it is, but we're gonna find out. Uh, I think it's a rain contra. So yeah, maybe terrorism is a bad idea. Maybe maybe I should have held terrorism. But if I held terrorism, then it couldn't come back turn ten for me. Right. You know, and then it, and it couldn't be activated by Iranian hostage crisis. I pulled two cards from him on turn 10. So, I don't know. You guys just don't aren't on the 5D chess train. All right. So, he flips Panama on with its central dom. Okay. And we're going to yeah. space solidarity. Fine. Yeah, I would have considered holding solidarity through the reshuffle, but all right. That's fine. Okay, we get Cal and Star and an act of Star Wars. Yep. And green and <laughs> Europe. Green and Europe. And you sorry. <laughs> Holy Christ. Okay. Yeah. So thanks, JR, for the uh oh, nice, nice W. Thanks, JR. Appreciate that. Okay. Well, and we can't even just headline Cal because we could lose to We Will Bury You. So it has to be Pershing. And we want to dump Europe AR1, but we can't do that. We have to, we have to dump Cal AR1. Oh, that's right. And JR points out correctly yes. that, the, that Star Wars is, is free. Yes. Now the question is, does Ted figure this out, or does he just freak out uh, that Star Wars is always a DEFCON card? Oh, well, there we go. Star Wars is going to pull CRG, which is annoying. That's right. This is this is the, the rare circumstance where Star Wars could actually be beneficial to you. Of course, he headlines CRG and ruins that, probably because he knows you have Star Wars in your hand. But okay... We can respond to this CRG, which is not that bad. 
uh, by playing Cal for ops. Yes. And presumably jamming some more stuff into West Germany. Okay, yeah, but JR, if I space, if I just play Cal, space gray and hold Star Wars, I'm playing Usuri. So, and Apex. Yep. So you could give Star Wars and give him another CRG. But you have to do that quickly before he plays something better. Right. And obviously you have to do that before you space green. Before space green. Okay. So this is just an easy cal for ops. I'm just going to put them all in there because I... Yes. Yeah, so we, we have an 11 VP lead. Yeah, and we just want to make sure we don't give up a Europe Dom. If he wants to flip one battleground in Africa, he can go for it. That's fine. That makes sense to me. Yeah, the other thing JR is pointing out, this is more what I was thinking, um, was that if I hit space and he doesn't, um, then I can play Star Wars for free. But if you hit space, you have to space grain. Right. And then it ends up in the discard. But that's not what I was thinking, Justin. I was thinking if I hit space... Then Star Wars, and he misses his, Star Wars isn't a problem. Star Wars is already not a problem. Okay. Um, yeah, right. yeah, but it's less of a problem if I hit my space roll and he doesn't. <laughs> less of a problem that way. Okay. There's one small step, so he takes back Europe Dom. I think that stops Asia Dom. It does. Okay, we'll retake Asia Dom with Burma. So glad we got Burma. Yeah, he got a, finally we got Burma on a Saturday night. Okay, he spaces right. and hits. <clears throat> so my dream of <clears throat> mitigating Star Wars is dead. So just give it now, right? You just give it and he's going to get CRGs. Right? You give it. He gives CRGs. We space grain and we hold you, Surrey. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. I believe I read the Star Wars card first. To make yeah, sure to, to see if it understand. says you automatically lose the game if your yeah. USSR triggers this. And yep. it doesn't say that. Yep. And then I go back and look at the discard again. I did something similar the first time. I played uh, I played Missile Envy um, as USSR on turn 10 AR7 to guarantee myself a win. Yeah. And I looked at the discard pile. Okay, we will bury you. Olympics Summit. Okay, are there any other cards that Missile, that Missile Envy could hit that lose me the game? And I'm like looking on like Twilight Strategy. <laughs> <laughs> like, did I miss something? So, okay, I, I, I hear you on this. Fine. It's nerve-wracking. I, dude, I still read the Olympics card every time I need to make that yeah. decision. <laughs> I, I just I always get confused between the participate and boycott. Okay, so CRG is going to go Nigeria, Algeria, Burma, uh, maybe Philippines. Okay, is that here? Fine. So we'll take yeah, back really Nigeria and Burma. Okay. okay. All right. That was pretty harmless. Yep. Now we can space grain. Yeah, I, I got lucky. The the I, I I do think in I mean obviously hindsight I do think he should have triggered the reshuffle with Omit. Yeah. Yeah. With you having a, a good path, with him having a known gunman, and you yeah. having a being in war games territory. Yeah, I think the war games threat alone. Yeah. I mean, the Europe case is compelling, and I, I have certainly cavalier there. That, that certainly could have gone the other way. But again, um, you know, and then I end up drawing it turn nine. So. Okay, so we're up eight VPs. We have a nice. Uh, which looks like 
seven VP dominant in Asia. We have a six VP dominant in Africa and a five VP dominant in South. So that's 18 plus the eight is 26 for us. Europe is five for him. Central's two. Uh, and Middle East is three, presumably four when we give AWACS. So 28 for us to 11 or 12 for him. We're up 16. Um, yeah. Okay. So we're just going to go ahead and wait to space green until they are seven. Okay. Well, come on now. I can't let him. Yeah. Okay. No, you're right. You're right. It's fine. Okay. Now yeah, Asia Dom is stopped. Asia Dom is stopped. No one has mill ops. It's great. So he has the scoring. He does not have the scoring. This works. Nope, no, it doesn't no, work this time. No. One short, one no, two short. Okay, and he gets the mill ops and coos Haiti and is not it's excited about the six. roll. So okay, it's down to six. Okay. GG. Oh, come on, Ted. Really? Iranian hostage crisis comes back and terrorism. <laughs> Uh, a guilt-free bear trap. We get Asia, which is still a, which is still two VPs for us, uh, and we get and of course we get brush. What's our brush target? Italy, just to be a jerk, I assume. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna roll the dice on brush. Get out of here. Yeah. Uh, okay. Lads again. <laughs> How many games you headline lads twice, Justin? Uh, I gotta tell you, it's rare. I I. It's uh yeah. I want my five op Muslim Revolution coup on Venezuela and I want it bad. And I want it now. It's my five op coup and yeah. I want it now. <laughs> there and then he ruins it. By the name of Bert and Bert the turtle. Sorry. <clears throat> okay. So we're not getting our coup. No, we're not. But we can do this. Yep. Very to dumb. So he needs to do a bunch of stuff. He needs to have Middle East and Central and voice. Uh, okay. He well, has Middle East. There's a piece of it. So he takes a but VP lead. Yeah. We're going to take it right back. Yeah. Okay. Well, that's a little bit annoying, but... Uh, yeah, we're going to do this. Yeah, he, he can't be happy to see that. No. No. Yep. <laughs> you just know it's coming. Yeah, JR points out correctly that we would have Venezuela if we didn't invent terrorism earlier. You know what, JR? Just give De Gaulle here. Yeah, you, uh, you know what Missile Envy does. Ted, you know what Missile Envy does. <laughs> Just give him the three ops. What do I do with this? Just I should have cooked. Get our mill ops in Ku Cameroon. No, yeah, we're, we're, no. Unless you're a venting brush, which you said you're not rolling the dice on brush. Yeah. Well, I think that's what I was saying. I think I wanted to prevent him from cooing anymore. And then I was thinking, okay, well, I'll, I'll have brush for uh, for the mill ops. So I think that's what I was thinking. Is I'll, just, I'll break that because if he wants to coo again, he can go for it. I'll take the more stable Algeria. Yes, yeah, good, has... good point, good point, James. And yes, if you give brush, uh, if you give brush to missile envy, you still get you get the two BPs. And they happen before the war outcome, yep. right? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. 
Yeah, so now he's got a choice to make. Now he's going to take back Algeria, and I can probably just keep poking. We can well, also just, like, event, get just event terrorism, terrorism now. Yeah, just get the last so you get the last AR. Yep, yeah, same is true as if, if Star Wars pulls Brush War, they are Green pulls it and, and, and uses it. All right. Well, I'm sorry you're not satisfied. I thought this game was higher quality than the previous one I had sent you. Yes. Yes. You've sent me you've sent me some duds before. Oh, there's a war games redraw. Yep. So he pokes Brazil. So he's poking and jamming and making it so we can't just event terrorism and be done with it. Uh, but I guess I guess it's AR five. At this point we could do it and then we have a guilt free three and a guilt free three to finish if we want it if we don't want to use China. Yeah, but I think using China is fine. I'll just, we'll just, I'll just put the ball back in his court, status quo. One less AR. Yeah, we're just running the clock down. Yeah. Yeah. Which is always good. And if he has any of these scorings. Yeah, game's over. Oh, yeah. Yes. So the that board means... again, Africa five for you, South five for you, Asia six. So the board 16 for you, Europe five, Central two, Middle East four for him. So 11 plus the five. Suez and Indy Reds. So yeah, you're, you're comfortably ahead here. Yeah. Okay, he takes a Nigeria coup, misses on the roll. One last miss, missed roll. Okay. Well, to be fair, I missed a bunch of rolls in yeah. the beginning. Yeah, okay. So this is just a bear trap, take Nigeria back for Dom, right? And poke something. I don't know why, why would you play bear trap? Play brush for Okay, play a brush, sure. All right. All right, so 5-0. and 5-0. Oh. and oh. In your Atlantic League. In Atlantic League. Uh, basically locking in a playoff uh, playoff spot, especially with how the group is going. top three, right, from the division? Top three, yes. Only three of us have won any games uh, okay, in Group so, D. So, um, yeah, so Steven would have to go... Six and one, or I guess, yeah. Well, I mean, I'd have a tiebreaker over him. Yes. So he he would have to win all six of his other games, um, and be six and one. Yeah. So you're uh, five and zero. Oh. Yeah. I guess it's possible turn score could come into it if I beat you, you and uh, uh and, and Alan. If I beat you, Stephen and George, and Alan wins out, we could all wind up six and one. Uh, but that that requires me to win a lot more games in Atlantic League, which is a thing I seem incapable of doing. So we'll see. Right, but if we all end up six and one, then we all advance. We all advance, and it's just a question of seeding, which uh, decide which would be decided by turn score. Um, okay. Oh, but you're saying okay. So, but if we all end up, so if you beat me, you've already lost to Allen, but I've beat Allen, so we'd all end up six and one, and then it be so the the head to head wouldn't matter, and then it'd go to turn score. Yes. Yes, and it wouldn't matter for advancing, but it would matter for seeding, uh, because everyone else, obviously, if we all went six and one, would have at least three losses. But then, and then the group winner gets a buy. Yeah, right? group winner gets a buy. So that's that's consequential and important. Yes. Okay. So, uh, but again, that we're we're a long way away from that because that requires me to beat you and Stephen and George. So, um, that. Uh, that's a, that's a long way away. You also have to take care of business uh, against Moshe, and then I think Alan's got three more games as well. So a lot of a lot of Twilight struggle left in Atlantic League, um, but uh, been a good season so far. We had some uh, had some interesting games. This was a good one. Your turn nine hand was hilarious and fun, uh, and I yeah I think there are a few things I would have done differently, but but well played, well deserved win, and uh, yeah five and zero oh is uh, five and zero oh must be nice. Yep. Feeling good. So I will uh let's let's hope I, I have Moshe on um on Wednesday. 
Okay. And then, uh, you know, I figure we'll probably let you uh, finish out your games. Um, and then you and I can play. Okay. Uh, and we'll, and we'll do it. Are. We'll yeah. do a ban a dual banter stream for our. Yeah, our last I'm games. thinking about that. I have lost to you I, I, three or four times in a row with that. Um, oh yeah, I think I think I've beaten you twice in ITSL, once OTSL, once RTSL, once Atlantic. Oh, um, so five. So, so Shit. It's, yes, I'm I, I am five and zero against. Even though our record is pretty much even, if if not a slight edge to you, in our games before joining this community. Uh, I am five and zero oh in official ITS sanctioned games against okay. you. I, I might bail on the banter then. Oh, come uh, on! No, I need to concentrate, man. <sighs> so I can so I can do things like not protect Europe. Uh, okay, and get and and play terrorism and and pull Latin American debt crisis. Yeah, when you, you could just sit back last. and wait for him to just hand over Venezuela. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah, yeah. I need to concentrate so I can do all those things. Okay. Good. All right. Well, that makes me sad, but uh, my, my viewers do like the banter streams, uh, and I like just, you know, winning, uh, winning yeah, five in a row yeah. against you. But, uh, okay, fine. Well, we'll I, I, I'm gonna, I, I've reached out to George. I will reach out to Steven. We'll get that scheduled, and then we'll, uh, we, can play, we can play our game after all that. All right. We'll figure it out. Maybe just, just like lose two of them, and then, it will, and then I'll banter with you. Then it, it, okay. Yeah, then it won't matter for me. Okay. Just lose, lose both of the other two. Yep. Fantastic. So, and then, and then by banter, you just mean mock me the whole time yes. uh, about losing and failing to make Atlantic League playoffs for the third time in four. Yeah, years. it'd be great if you just lost games and then Alan lost games and I just had it locked up. Then, yeah, then that would be ideal. Okay. Excellent. So do that. All right. Well, thanks everybody for watching. I uh, can't imagine you're still watching now. Um, but uh, Ted, <laughs> any final thoughts on this one before we wrap up? No, I don't know what you want me to do here. You're you're constantly like, hey, record your games, record your games, record your games, and then you get all mad when I do and send them to you. I I so I know I like doing this. I just don't like when you say, oh, well, I could just lose to Europe Control right here for no reason. Um, let's just allow that to happen when I literally dominate all five other regions. Um, but okay, sure, and it worked out well for you this game. Couldn't you know? And we, we just drew we just drew Reformer and Chernobyl turn eight, so sometimes that happens. Um, I I like I like it when you get a little bit punished for your recklessness, Ted. That's all. That's all. That's all I'm mad about. No, 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 no. Chernobyl Reformer UN on turn three with CIA. It's all good. Yeah, yeah. So Ted being reckless uh, turns out great. Uh, yes. Once again. So, okay, let's carry that over to our team games. Sounds good. All right. Uh, thanks, everybody, for watching. I uh, don't have another game scheduled yet. I'm trying to get on the calendar with George. I'm going to email Steven so we can uh, do that. And uh, JR and I actually, I think, are going to play early next week. Uh, we're going to play our OTSL game. JR won't be able to stream that. His internet's terrible because he's hanging out with his mother. Um, so uh, we'll do a banter stream for that one. So looking forward to that. Uh, until next time, for Ted Livermore, this is Justin Abramson signing off. That was fun, but now it's done. So long, everybody.